So I bought some potatoes from the grocery store and they were already starting to seed. And by seed, it means that they started to sprout. And each of these are called an eye and they each will make a potato seed with many potatoes. So what I did was I cut up the eyes off of the potatoes and I'm putting them aside. I've already done a bag here, but let me show you what to look for. You wanna look for organic potatoes because those are likely to have what I call, or what is called eyes. Um, and again, it's just the potato that may look like it's gone bad. So this is a bag that I haven't yet cut up. This is the same type of potato and I will take out one so that you can see what it looks like again. That's the eye. And so you wanna cut around it. And then we're just gonna let this dry out a little bit. But in fact, I'm just gonna go ahead. It's nice and rainy today. I'm gonna put a layer of dirt. I'm just gonna sit the potato in and I'm not gonna cover it up yet. I'm gonna um, wait a couple of days before I cover it up, cover it up with dirt um, because the moisture, I don't want the potato itself to kind of dry up and get like all really yucky and moldy and stuff because it there is a chance that it can do that if it doesn't completely dry since I'm just cutting these. Um, but I just wanted to show you that you can use what you buy from the store. These are organic. These are not organic potatoes, but these are um, organic will give you the best option. But if they start to sprout and it's like a local potato, then I would say just try it uh, and see like how it works. But this is a, just a normal uh, white potato. And this is um, a local red potato that's grown in North Carolina, which is where I am. So I hope it works for you. Uh, but this is how potatoes are grown. You cut them up like this where you have the eyes and then um, you plant them. That's a really nice one that's ready to go.